Hi, my username is Stormcab. I've been using YouTube for about three years now and have uploaded about several dozen films. Recently, YouTube has had some exciting updates including a widescreen viewer and the option to watch in high quality or high definition. One of the issues with the new viewer though is that some of my old videos that are widescreen no longer fit exactly in the frame, so I've had to re-upload them so they fit perfectly. The new high quality option was something I stumbled on accidentally. I had a small video clip in MPEG-2 that I uploaded. Soon after uploading, I noticed there was a little um, symbol underneath saying, watch in high quality. Um, I assumed because it was uh, MPEG-2 and I hadn't converted it to DivX because it was such a small file, that was the reason for the high quality. Usually I would um, have to convert to DivX because YouTube had a 100 megabyte upload limit. Now it's gone up to one gigabyte. I can always upload in MPEG-2 and get the full quality that I want. Several days ago I came across a problem. Some of my videos that I was uploading, my new ones, weren't being uploaded with a high quality option available. I was pulling my hair out, I was going absolutely nuts trying to figure out why it wouldn't work. One of the videos did upload in high quality but the playback was really jittery, it wasn't smooth at all. So um, I did some looking around on um, the forums and discovered that there's a hack, a code you can type in to the uh, web address or the UR, what you call it, the URL, which fixes this. It's absolutely brilliant. I uploaded this um, video of uh, RF Waddington 2007. It was an air show I visited and I filmed it. And uh, then I edited a movie together with some music. Um, as you can see, at the time I filmed it and put it on, um, it was in widescreen, but it's not fitting the new player. As you notice as well, there's no high quality option. So if I pause that and then go to my new one, you'll notice that it fills the screen perfectly. So this is my logo just at the start of the film. This is my um, latest movie. Everybody was Kung Fu fighting for comic relief, Red Nose Day. 2009. It's um, something I did, another video um, with my Stormtrooper outfit. Um, you'll notice that in the bottom right hand corner there's a high quality option. Now this wasn't present on the RF Waddington video, which I'll just show you again. It's not there. This is how it works. Go up to the URL, or the address bar as it is better known, and type in and FMT, lowercase, equals 18. Now, you can either click the arrow key at the end of the address bar, or just hit enter. Now watch this. Bingo, high quality option enabled. Now to prove this actually works on a lot of older videos as well, I'm going to go through my selection and pick something a little bit older that doesn't have the higher quality enabled. Um, okay, Break My Stride, our trip to Jamaica, I did a year ago. Um, there is no high quality option available. And the screen doesn't fill the widescreen perfectly. Okay, so now we're going to go up to the top again, to the URL, add and FMT equals 18. Press enter or click the green arrow, enter. And bingo, see? The high quality option is enabled. So even the older videos get it. Oh, wait a minute. But oh, it's actually playing the whole screen. I didn't know it could do this. We've discovered on air that this actually takes your old videos that are widescreen and fills the whole screen when you use this option. Fantastic! Oh, that's my wife. <laughs> Enough of that. We'll test it on a couple of other videos just to make sure. Um, go back even further. Um, okay, we will go with the Star Wars Celebration Europe. And FMT equals 18. Enter. Does it work? Yep, high quality. There it is. Oh, it doesn't work. Oh, well, that's odd. 
it works on some but doesn't work on all of them okay um, there's another thing I can't figure out now we're going to talk about high definition now I originally uploaded this uh, video called Space Cowboy uh, last year the high quality is enabled but it is still um, smaller than the actual screen size itself so what I did was I uploaded two more versions, one that filled the screen and one that was in high definition. You will notice that there is a high definition option available, HD, in red. If you want to watch in HD, you press this, and then you get transferred to this larger HD viewing screen. The problem is the playback isn't very smooth and the audio is out of sync. So what you do, there's a new code, if you go to the address bar, and this time type in AND FMT equals 22, enter, it's not 100% smooth still, but what happens is the audio is corrected and it works perfectly. This will be down to your individual broadband speed, mine isn't very fast, I think it's something only like 2 or 4. Another thing you'll notice is that this code makes playback much smoother. So in this particular video I've just shot, you can see that it's very jittery. Now, if I go up and type in the code, and FMT equals 18, enter. Let's fast forward to that bit again. you see it's much smoother. So not only does it give a higher quality option, it also makes any playback that's unsmooth smooth. Or smoother. I read that the reason for all this messing about by YouTube is that, um, to well basically to keep the bandwidth down. Apparently 95% of the bandwidth we use on the planet is people uploading YouTube videos. Um, if the, if the quality of the video plays fine in normal quality then they don't give you the high quality option but if it doesn't then they'll give you the high quality option so you're gonna have to use this this hack to get around this the exact specification for your video being able to be played high quality isn't known yet I've tried I've tried many times I've looked on forums I have had no luck but um, a sort of good round figure is to make sure that your your uh, resolution is more than 640 by 480 and that should do the job. Now remember, the URL, the address bar, type in and FMT equals 18 or 22. 18 for high quality, 22 when you're watching a high definition enabled video. Enjoy.